So I just wanted to do a little look into my um, workshop right now. So this is one of the printers here that's that's uh, running. So right now this 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 one here is an any cubic Chiron, and it it has a bed of 16 and a half inches by 16 and a half inches by 17 inches tall. So this could do six face shields every four to five hours. Uh, I just had to replace the hot end. The hot end is the essentially the the piece that draws these these uh, or that melts the plastic and draws what it's supposed to draw and and uh, puts it puts it in uh, in place. Over here we have an any cubic mega s i3 mega s. This one here will do two face shields every hour and twenty minutes ish, and its print volume is seven and a half or eight inches I believe by seven and a half, and will do eight inches tall. Over here, you have an i3 Mega, not a Mega S, just an i3 Mega. So this is a slightly step down from that. It just has a couple pieces that are a little bit lower end than the one behind me. Not much of a big difference. This one here is, again, 7.5 or 8 inches by 7.5 or by 8 inches by 8 inches tall. Uh, this will do the two of these in the same hour, hour and 20 minutes. Over here, we have a Winehow Duplicator i3 Plus. This one here is uh, a newer brand that I haven't used before. The bed is a little bit smaller than all the rest of my printers. Um, so this one here will do, it's a, I think it's a six and a half inch or seven inch bed by, by six and a half or seven inches this way. And it'll do about seven, six and a half to seven inches tall. I can do six ear savers here every print. Over here is another any cubic Chiron. Again, 16 half or 17 inches this way, 16 half inches that way, 17 inches tall. This will do six of the face shields. This is the one here that was down for quite a while. I was waiting for a, a part, a new extruder, which is this part back here. Finally arrived today. This is its first print of the face shields uh, since having that part installed. I did a few test prints. The test prints came up beautifully, so I'm actually doing, doing uh Doing this face shield print, which again, four to five hours, will will uh, do the six prints. So, between the five printers that I have running, because I have five running now, um, I can do uh, the face shields. I do between the two uh, between the two big ones. Um, I can do twelve every four to five hours, and then the two little ones will do these two little ones here. We'll do two uh, face shields every hour and 20 minutes so I'd say times three just to be whatever just to be quick and and uh, and, uh, and uh, simple uh, I can get uh, uh, 12 out of that 12 out of this I get 24 every four to five hours uh, of the frames and these ear savers here every hour and a half to two hours I can get uh, six uh, which which is which is uh, pretty good I also have the code loaded on this one here so I can flip this one over and start making uh, ear savers whenever I want to. Actually, I can, I can do it on all the machines, I just have the G-code only loaded on this one. So I can flip it over and do seven on this one every hour and a half to two, or two hours so I can get a lead on those. So that's what I'm printing right now. Normally, all of these printers, except for this one here because this one was added specifically during this time to the PPP. Not sure if I'm gonna keep it yet. I haven't quite made, made my choice, but normally, these are all printing uh, board game inserts, uh, accessories that I do for my own games, and and uh, so on to kind of upgrade my my pieces. But for now, they're doing PPEs, uh, face shields, and ear savers to help nurses, doctors, uh, um, um, uh, continuing care agents in long-term care homes, uh, uh, retail staff, some 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 retail staff that have. Uh, made sure that grocery stores are open because they are a sense of service. Some uh, bus drivers, like myself, have been using the ear savers and these face shields. So they've been printing. They've been printing strong, uh, doing all of that. Uh, and hopefully, when uh, COVID-19 dies down, I'll be back to printing more board game pieces. I do, however, have a lot of them already done uh that i have to go through because i printed quite a bit so that should keep me going on that end uh or organizing my uh, my uh boxes but to date for these face shields i've printed and put out over 2000 i'm probably at about 22 or 2300 of these that i've actually put out and people have picked up 
Uh, and for the ear savers, I'm probably at close to two or three hundred of these that I've put out. And I've got about 60 or 70 upstairs right now ready, ready to go. Uh, so uh, uh, I'll be probably putting out those today or tomorrow. Um, so that's what I've been doing with the printers now. And now I've got all five printers up and running, printing, printing, uh, printing strong and ready, and ready to uh, get these things out here.